Hey everyone, it's Blue Lizard Jello, and welcome back to Blue Plays Terraria. And of course, this is a master difficulty with a hardcore character, Silverius 2.0. So what are we doing today? Well, I need to prepare for going underground. It's not time for me to go underground. It's time for me to prepare to go underground. A couple of ways of doing that. Number one, I need food. And while I have been getting some fruit from whacking these trees, I'm going to keep whacking them, see if I get anything else. That isn't really going to be the most efficient way of going about this, in my opinion. Uh, now, I do have some fruit. So I have already have two lemons, and I guess I had a grapefruit, but that is since gone. Uh, I learned just a moment ago, when I was actually prepping the beginning of this video, I learned that using a cooking pot and getting some fruits, you can actually get fruit salad, which is pretty good. You can also get lemonade with a lemon, or you can do fruit juice. And while they all only provide minor improvements to your stats, they offer it at different lengths of time. I And the fruit salad, the best one, is something like 25 minutes, which frankly is a long time. Okay. Um, I'm liking what I'm seeing here. Looks like some silver and plenty of iron. So let's grab this. I know we said we're gonna focus on food right now, but if we get enough iron, we can make a cooking pot. And with a cooking pot, that means I can actually cook more food. Oh boy, I do not have a hook. And I'm just realizing that if something decides to drop on my dome, I can get messy in a hurry. Uh, nope, didn't want a torch. There, there we go. Okay, not terrible. Oh, you know what we should also do today is find some clay, make some pots and get some stuff growing. We have so many herb bags. It's got to be some good stuff in there. What's our bomb situation looking like? 15? Not bad. Pretty excited to see more silver ore already, though. So if we could set some goals, if we could get an iron pickaxe... Oh, it is almost evening. If we could get an iron pickaxe, a cooking pot, and improve that fishing area right at the beginning. I would be pretty stoked about that. Oh, and get some plants going. I think those are some pretty solid goals. Hello, early gem tree. Am I that deep already? What kind of gem is it? Topaz, all right, not the best, but... I suppose it's better than nothing. Not really digging on a red slime right now. Sorry, friend. I need you to fall all the way down. <gasps> with me. With me, apparently. That was sloppy. Uh, we might be hanging out in this cave for the night if I can't... Uh-oh. Uh, no, no, not how I go. Okay, ready? You gotta jump. There we go. Just going over here to see if there's any clay, but I'll... That is here worm? Wow, more silver. And I'm not too afraid of being out at night because I do have my spawn protect did. Uh, what I do need, though, right now is a rope coil. Best thing. Love those. So we'll pitch forward for just another moment. Oh. That could indicate some more surface chests. Um. Or. Shoot. It's getting late. This is so unlike my last world gen, where I had no caves, and now I'm just... 
kind of inundated. Oh, and this looks like clay right underneath me. Oh, this looks like lots of clay. Okay, yep. Spend a moment doing this. Is that more clay? That's more clay. Okay, so we'll do this until we feel unsafe. Let's do that, okay? Especially evening. But getting potions going early, ugh. It's such a freeing feeling, it really is. What are we looking at? 75. It takes a good bit of clay. That's going to be, that's going to be a problem. Go, go, go. Alright, this just isn't worth it. Uh, then again. Silly as this is, they're not bothering me. Mostly because they can't. But you know, Blue. Do you really want to do this? Just do this. I mean... Come on. Smarter, not harder. <laughs> How's our iron situation? 27 iron ore, 30 silver ore. Okay. That 27 should be enough for a pickaxe. And that combined with what I have in the chest already, this is a huge clay deposit. Might be enough to do both a pickaxe and a cooking pot. I'm not sure. This is crazy. All right, you know what? Speed this up a little bit. Just gonna do just one there. And we're at over 200. I think that's probably sufficient. Let's call it. Dump what we can, beautiful. It's always nice to just see those flying out. All right, silver. That's not for a silver bow. Is three more damage than my copper. But what else can we do? Iron. So that's 13. A cooking pot requires 10. Wow, that's expensive. Okay, so we're definitely not getting both, but got a ruthless, which is fine. I mean, it's not really all that necessary. Uh, I'll tell you what, got some animals here. Sorry, guys. Come with me. I'll keep you safe. Oh, and don't forget, we want to just kind of soften these corners, yeah? And not kill the firefly that's waiting for it right there. Don't need you. Alright, old chew, no value. Bunnies, a little bit of value. <laughs> Sounds funny to say. Owl. Okay. So, what are we at? We're at three gold, not bad. I do want to go and craft... Shoot. Not craft. I want to make this fishing spot bigger, but... Obviously, doing it at night... A little bit on the danger side. I have lots of recalls, which is honestly my saving grace right now. Uh-oh. No, 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 no. <laughs> well, what can we do right now? I guess is the real question, huh? Oh, okay. We could. Didn't realize I had another mana star. Perfect. How many clay pots can I make? A whopping 41. I love that. All right. Well, in the meantime... Let's go ahead and grab all of these herb bags and see what we get, yeah? No way. Shiverthorn and Shiverthorn seeds. Got Daybloom and Daybloom seeds. Fireblock. Moonglow and Blinkroot? Oh. oh my gosh. 
Oh my gosh. We... I, I can't really explain just how spoiled rotten we just got with this. There was no deathweed seeds that I can see. But my gosh, we got everything else. Okay. Well. Pardon me. Capturing some animals. But really what I do is I... I these animals I sell them and then the merchant sets them free again it, it's a it's it's a thing we do yeah okay so what do we want this to look like it's not gonna be anything fancy right now but I don't want it to be just on the ground either what about just a long you know what we're gonna do it's gonna be simple it's gonna be ugly and it's gonna work wait don't do that don't ever ever take what's happening over here you wanna come up can you come up actually i don't really care we're gonna go up one two three four five six just there right so that's one Basically, I just want enough to have all all the pots side by side so we can make a greenhouse. Guys, I mean, I appreciate your company, but you know what's going to happen. Okay, so let's see how we did. Gosh, should we get it almost exact? Doggone close. Excellent. So, we're going to do... Shiverthorn's really important because Shiverthorn gives us danger sense really early. Daybloom is good. Moonglow, I think, is better. So, let's do all the Moonglow. Okay, and then all the Blink Root, and then whatever's left over. Okay. Uh, Fire Blossom, I can't remember how these grow. They have specific requirements. Okay, that's fantastic. It's ugly as all get out. It's not going to win any awards, but... There we go. So far, so good. I, I might actually just open this up and have my uh, friend here help me kill him. There we are. You're still alive. You're good. All the stars. Okay, that's going to be another mana star for me. Okay. Now, I also can make some topaz gem corns. I think I got... Did I get one? I did not even get one. So I could go underground and plant that. It's very, very slow. Don't expect to uh, get rich quickly trying to use the gem corn trees. I am just so happy about this. In fact, in fact, in fact, Do I have any sand? I don't have any sand. I need sand so I can start making some potions. First off, sell more owls. Keeping all the bait right now. Ugh, I'm not well fed. Okay, so we have... We have some plans and it's almost morning. I would not mind grabbing the last couple stars though. All right, we're gonna start risking it because it's gonna be. Oh, never mind. It is now officially morning. I want to go get some sand. I am changing up the order of operations here just just a little, and that is to get sand so I can make potions. Just hitting all the trees. See if I get anything good out of them. Hmm. 
Hmm. That could actually function as both a forest and a desert fishing spot. Now, if I'm careful, I could take out that vulture. Not a lot of reason to do so, mind you. So I'm just gonna instead grab some sand and then probably recall on, on back. I guess getting cactus is not a terrible idea. I could at least get cactus. I don't even have wood armor. I can't tell you how bizarre it is for me not to have wood armor. All right, let's do it. There we go. Excellent. Oh, and there's even some water leaf, but it's not raining, so I don't think I'll get seeds out of it. Oh, okay. So plants do have different growing parameters. Uh, and not only that, but they also have seed parameters. So sometimes, depending on the time of day or the weather, then you might be able to harvest the plant but no seeds, or it might just not, you know, bloom at all. For example, moon glow, I think it's guaranteed during full moons and blood moons, and then after that, it might just be a time-based thing, I'm not sure. Okay, this is, this is good. Okay, let's kill the slime, let's make our way back a little bit. I might grab some more sand. What am I at? 85? Yeah. Let's just get a little bit more. Let's get at least 100. Actually, what we could do is just lower this a little bit. Gonna make some steps. Okay. And do the same here. Okay, another vulture spawned. All right, because if I just do this, I'm gonna go to 150. There, okay. Happy with that. Already got a day bloom. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn, well, first off, did I get enough for full cactus armor? I did, I actually did. And maybe even a cactus sword while I'm at it. 10 damage versus nine. Got a nimble. It's not auto swing, but it's a lot bigger. And it's it slightly harder. Okay. Our first defense. Well, okay. No, we had a shackle. That's true. That's true. Right. What are we doing? We are making glass. And... We are going to make bottles. We also need to start making terrariums since we're going to start... Oh, crafting a... Terrarium. Hold on. Offline. What does that mean? Does this really glow? Whoa. Hold on. Are you serious? That's awesome. It looks stupid there, but that's super cool that I have a glowing wall now. But that's not what I meant to do. Sorry. Head in the game, Blue. A lot of bottles. As many as you can. Okay. Then, since this is my plants, for now at least, I'm going to make a little table. A little cactus table. Seems fitting, right? Put that there, and then I need one, one bottle there. Oh my gosh. Hold on. That's for you. Yeah, that's right. And you know what? That's for you. Yeah, you're welcome. Now you guys can just stare at butterflies all day. So this is now an alchemy table. I can also do a firefly in a bottle. Get out. Well, we gotta do that. So much for making any sort of potions.
Oh, it hangs? <gasps> oh my gosh. I love everything. All right. Anyway, I digress. Oh, new day. New tree whacking. I'm going to make my entire earnings in Terraria on critters. Come back. I actually want to get more fruit. Okay, but now that I'm at water, I turn all these into lots and lots of water bottles. I remember, no more auto swing. But I think this has better knockback too, right? Average knockback versus very weak knockback, yeah. So what do I still need to do if I want to accomplish my goals? I still need to get a cooking pot, right? Oh, and the fishing. Ooh, that's a lot. So, if I put in... Hold on. All this water. As well as cactus, because I think cactus is good for something. They bloom, throw that under there. Water leaf, that goes there. And we can now already make regen, swiftness, mana regen, magic power, invent. Oh, because I have the stars. Uh, invisibility, which is terrible. Night owl, thorns, archery, builder, danger sense, and flipper. You know, danger sense is going to be coming with us, and I can only make one. But even that is going to prove to be invaluable. 10 minutes of pseudo safety. Okay, good, good, good. Might as well make some stairs at some point here, right? Okay, lots of seeds. Okay, quick stack. Right, so we have a few moments. I would like to get a cooking pot. So, why am I looking here? Where's my best bet? To go there? Or here? The only thing that concerns me there is the desert, but I think we'll be okay. Now's the time though, I am going to be well fed. Is this tree? Is this a gem? No, okay. Just looks very, very bizarre. All right, here we go. Get all the vine ropes. Hey, I saw the bunny. See how he spared his life? So as long as we move away from the desert, we'll be okay. Uh, let's see. Want to make some rope coils. I still don't have any glow sticks. All right, here's what we're going to do. Danger sense. Look at that boulder trap. Early boulder. That is, that is nasty. Especially because look at, look at what they expect you to drop down onto. Uh, let's get rid of that actually. I know it's really dark, but I'll light it up here in just a moment, right? So I'm going to do this. I mean, that's just, that's mean. Lots of cobwebs would be wonderful. Heart crystal, first heart crystal. That means we can get the nurse to move in. And uh, I have a I have a rather strong fondness for the nurse uh, as of late. I won't go into the details why, but if you saw the last season, you know what happened. You know what I did. All right, and no reason not to use that. Gosh, I need to get ropes up here. Did I see a bat? 
thought I just saw a bat. Am I crazy? Oh, <gasps> nope, no bat, but there's a house already. Wait, I know. Do I see a dry water chest? This is unreal. Okay. It's not, okay. Shoot. Okay, so there's a very real problem with this. Being so close to desert means that the desert worm can spawn. If that desert crawler spawns, I'm dead. I mean, it's, it's, it's over. So we need to get in and get out. Cloud in a bottle, amazing. Other really, really good stuff, good. We're just gonna do some looting here. Uh, grab the statue. What do we got? A breathing reed. I love the breathing We even got shark bait, which I don't need. Goodness gracious. Coin portal. Just a fiver? Okay, that's all right. Uh, what I don't have, though, I don't have a piggy yet. So that's a bit disappointing. What else can I get rid of? Squirrel? Should, should I just set the squirrel free? It's not really how it works, but, you know. Okay, you have to be careful with this sand. For that very reason, right there. Okay, good. Now, I want to go back up because I want this slime to go over my head. There we go. I saw some cobwebs over there. That honestly looks like that might be another house. Ugh. Okay, let's let's try this. If there's a, you know what, this is silly because I don't have. Okay, just mine up and hope there's no sand. Okay, all right, it's not a house. It's not a house. Sometimes it is a house, son of a gun. <laughs> it's my second house. I've already doubled the number of houses I found in this playthrough compared to my last. What do we get? Hermes, are you kidding? Unbelievable. A free anvil. I will always take another anvil. Even though I can't even pick it up right now. Got this iron. Okay, what else can I get rid of? Uh, you know what we can do? Is actually turn this wood or the... You minx. Uh, do I need to be well fed again? I do, so we'll just eat my lemon. How's our danger? We have six more minutes on danger. Is that gold? Oh, that is gold right there. Uh, wow, we have gold. All right. An explosive trap? What is this? So gold is the equivalent of platinum, or vice versa. So you only get one or the other in a world gen. So I've just gotten gold instead of platinum, which is the lesser of the two, but still, getting it this early is pretty nice. Granted, I'm not, you know, picking anything up right now. We'll figure that out in a moment. Okay. What do we get rid of? Squirrel. Barry, where do you want me to go? I mean, really, where do you want me to go? I'll go. Uh, I, I want that. You know, we don't need that short sword anymore. I want to know where the fairy wants me to go. Oh, he's going to fly off. That's another danger sense. 
I need that danger sense. Um, Bunny, you're gone. Heart crystal. Oh, man. I'm going to check that out, too, because that also looks like another house. <laughs> Do I have more glow sticks, or is that it? Nope, I have a couple more. Where's my bombs? Uh, once again, blue, you do not replace. There we go. You don't replace recalls. All right, you just don't. You don't do it. Okay, break up to one forty. Yep. Grab the silver, and then we're going to go check that out. And then we're getting out of here. Already technically wrapping up, or past wrapping up time, but... This is important. Lots of clay up there. Don't need it at the moment. This could become a fishing spot, too. Um, I want to get out. Oh, I forgot I have Cloud in a bottle! And that looks just like some copper. Okay, Skelly in there? That's okay. It's a house. It's... My third house already. Um, I need to... Hmm... What do I do about you? I think what I honestly do is this. Okay. And while I'm here, go ahead and sticky bomb that. For some reason, that just made me think it was lava, and uh, that scared me. Come on. What am I doing? Why am I doing this? I just go get the house blue. All right, hold on. More silver. Got nearly all of it. And more silver. We're getting close to the desert. I just saw a rolling cactus over there. gonna get me killed. Okay, I do want to get... Oh, it's a diamond! Oh, what do I get rid of? Single rope coil? Sure. Okay, we got a bat to deal with. I think that's okay. Less so when it's multiple. Okay. Now just imagine if I was hitting it. I like that you're down there right now. So you know what? Oh, you're not down there anymore. Uh, I don't know if you can make that jump. Yes. Uh, no. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Jump up here. We're okay. In fact, that works out better. Oh. oh, I see some gems there, too. All right, chandelier, statue, what? all the stuff I gotta get rid of. I don't need a strong copper pickaxe anymore. You know, what we could do is turn all of these into torches. Get the statue. Hey, okay, what's in here? A mace. And Jester's Arrows. Healing Potions, Water... Love Water Walking. I can combine this with... Some torches. I think 99 torches to make a... a well, alright. That goes away. 
I'm gonna have to make some difficult suit. Owl, you're free. What's better, shirt? All right, get rid of the shurikens. Okay. Okay, we're almost done. Let's grab these. Of course, I'm gonna have to make more room. But this is a big vein. I don't know if it's 15 big. But I don't know that it's not. Okay, don't drown, Blue. Don't drown. What do you have? Don't worry about that. Oh, let's see. I know I'm being silly for keeping some of this stuff, but it makes me happy. They're blocked. That doesn't make me happy. 13? Are you kidding? Two away? Ah. I want to know what this slime is carrying. And so, it must die. Okay, ready? Silver ore. All right. You know what? Let's get out of here. Moon glow. Oh, just tried to hook. Can't hook. Good, 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 good. All right. Oh, not a lot of stuff just stacked. <laughs> not a lot of stuff just stacked at all. Look at all that silver, but we have iron uh, blocks. Let's make some room in blocks. Sorry, that's also going to be blocks and furniture and paintings. Jeez. And chests. <laughs> and statues. Oh, my word. Okay, now, if I'm not mistaken... Yeah, look at this. Flaming Mace from 16, or... Oh, it's 18 and 18. Oh. But it lights things on fire. So that's pretty cool. Yep. I'm okay with that. I'm very, very okay with that. Alright. Before we wrap up, we've got to do it. Not make the yo-yo. Where's my cooking pot? Oh, I need to make the iron bars. Just enough. And there we go. And now we can cook when, when we get food. Well, I dare say that was pretty good. Kind of went off script a little bit, and that's how you get killed. But so far, that hasn't happened. So I'm going to go ahead and call this a win. And I'm also going to go ahead and call this a part there. That is going to do it for this episode of Blue Plays Terraria Master Difficulty with Hardcore Character. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you're still enjoying. And I'll see you next time.